All right, so step one is let's find a YouTube video that we want to turn into a digital product. So I, this is my channel here. I'm gonna click on this Today, one. Gonna... I really liked this video. I taught an entire business model in it, and I wanna turn this into a digital product like an ebook. So what I'm gonna do now is click on here on the description area and come on down to the bottom and I'll be able to show the transcript. All right, here's the transcript of the video. I'm next gonna to toggle off the timestamps. I'm just gonna copy all this. Copy, 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 copy. Now I'm gonna head into this transcript to digital product custom GPT that I built. There's a link down below if you wanna download it for free. And I'm gonna click on let's create a digital product from a transcript. Now it either wants to upload or if you, if you have it like on a PDF, you can upload it. Otherwise I'll paste in the transcript right here. And this is really cool. We'll check out what it's gonna do. There's the entire transcript. Now it's gonna go through and analyze the entire setup, both what are the themes, because it's going to give us three ideas of what it can build based on this. So first I'll figure out the main themes, the style of the teaching, who the audience is of the original content, because we wanna build a product that'll appeal to the same audience, as well as the transformation promise from the original thing. So it's going to go through and get all of that. And based on that, it creates three different angles of what digital product you can create, what ebook you can write, for example. So one from this is, looks like, walks through the entire playbook. Okay, I like that. Business strategy manual, so it's a little different. And then a story-driven transformation, a bit more like a nonfiction business type of book there. Let's go with angle number one. I'm simply gonna say one. And now it's gonna go through and actually generate a full outline based on the transcript for that specific angle of what came through in the video. Let's see here. Oh, now it's asking some additional questions. Nice. Let's see, what style do we want? Let's go professional and instructional. Let's make it a little businessy. But again, you do you. Now it's going to write out the entire outline for this ebook. It's going to give us our title page, target audience, table of contents, and then chapter by chapter based on the transcript we just gave it. Okay, so it's finished here. And now it has other options for what we can do. All I'm gonna do now is copy this entire uh, outline. You can review it and massage it and make it quite right, but this will be good enough for what we need to do. Take it all the way from the title page, copy. Now I'm gonna head over to the next tool, which is Gamma. Now there's a link down below for Gamma. If you don't know it, it is an awesome AI design tool. I'm gonna click on generate with AI and I'll paste in the text. Now you can choose what you want this to be. I'll make this a document. Think of it like a book and I'll paste in my entire outline. We just generated from the previous step. The formatting gets all messed up, but that's okay. We're not going to force it into a specific page by page design. We're going to give it the outline and let it surprise us. We're going to generate content from our notes or outline. And now what it's going to do is it's going to process everything we just fed it and give it the free form and now let us kind of work through the details of how we want this to be. Now we first want to decide, are we generating content? Yes, we're going to generate content because all I started with was an outline. Next, we're going to choose how big, how meaty do we want this to be? I've found personally that if I go into detailed and extensive, sometimes that can actually spill over and the formatting doesn't really fit nicely on a page. So I'll choose concise on this one. But again, it doesn't really cost more to make more, so you can decide which one works best for you. Now, this is kind of fun. We get to choose an entire theme for this entire document. And you can see what they do. Dark theme, light theme. That's kind of cool. Let's go with this style here. Select that theme. Image sources will generate all the images so it looks kind of the same. And I've found that I don't really like the photorealistic so much with AI. I do like the abstract, though. It just makes me happy. So we'll choose that with an auto select which image it's going to go through. And there we go. Next thing, very important, is choose how long you want this to be. A card is essentially, for an ebook, is basically a page. And depending on the plan you're at, you can go up to 60 pages. You can do 20 pages on the plan that I'm currently on. And that's going to work for me. I'll go ahead and click on Generate. And now it is starting to write the actual content, the copy, the images, page by page. When it decides it wants a better design, it will add the design in. It will generate images for each page based on the content of that page. Add the icon, so this is like a search icon for the web, which is perfect for that section. How cool is this? I'll skip ahead until the book is done being written. All right, so it's done building it. And a quick little example here, what I meant with uh, the concise. So that little dashed line you see right here, that's where the page is basically gonna cut off if it's a PDF. And so this is one that I would probably play with the design a little bit here, maybe add an additional card. Or in this case, I'm just going to change the, the style down to uh, heading two. 
Okay, so now it fits here on the page. We'll take a look at the final uh, page. We'll put it into presentation mode and let's head back to the top here. Again, this was done in seconds and we have a full ebook. I chose it to be very professional looking and sounding, so it's not gonna be as personalized as it could, but that's amazing. It's also very easy to change the layout. For example, this style is just not doing it for me for an ebook. It doesn't look like an ebook uh, style, but you can very easily change it to something that could work for you. And I'm just gonna click on that button and I'll find one that works for me. Something like that. A little bit better. All right, so that was step three, designing it out. And then from there, you just plug it into whatever sales tool you wanna use. I guess the first thing we should do here is we'll just share this and we'll export it as a PDF. And here's our finished ebook in PDF format. You can drag and drop this into any sales platform that you want. It is a full, I think 20 page, yes, the 20 page document that we generated without a single bit of editing and copywriting. But what's amazing about this, remember, we came from the design tool, from the analysis, directly from the source. And I gotta get off that face of mine. But this was our content, our ideas. Now, what can you do with this? You can make freebies, you can make your own digital products, you can build an entire business around this concept of taking assets that already exist and turning it into uh, you know, actual products. So there you go, guys. That's how you can take a transcript of your video or any video, really, and turn it into a digital product you can create and sell in minutes. There's a ton of extensions to this. You can build an entire business off of this framework. And if you want access to the entire tool, the GPT that actually analyzes and creates that content for you, just comment the word convert in the comments down below, and I'll send you everything we just used in today's video easy for you. All right. Hope this was helpful, guys. Go ahead. And if you found it helpful, please subscribe. It really helps the channel out. Like the video so YouTube knows to share with others. And I'll see you in the next video. Take care.